Sir, have you heard I have more news to share about Singular 2.0? Like way more. But first, the Talisman Extension Beta is now available to everyone in the Chrome store, meaning you can use it now without a spirit key on Chrome and Brave. Link to that below. Incredible presentation yesterday on the Crowdcast where we got to meet the team who made it happen. They talked community ownership, EVM, swaps, and some sage wisdom from Agile. Congratulations to him, my son-in-law Nipsey, Birdo, and the team. Thank you so much for building this. Oak Network announcing the crowd loan for their Kusama parachain Touring. Oak is laying the foundations for automated on-chain transactions, something we take for granted on Web2. This would unlock subscription services, payrolls, how about dollar cost averaging into a position? And they're looking to fundamentally change transactions and create an event-driven virtual machine they're calling Oak VM. Their crowd loan is going live on March 20th. They're giving out 16% of their 1 billion tour supply, and you can sign up here to get a ref link and be the first to know when they launch. Kabocha has got its Para ID 2113. Ooh, and Invarch appears to be reconsidering its stance on a Kusama slot. As we speak, this is something that the the team we're actively talking about discussing and considering if that's the case then we'll obviously we'll have some uh, some really exciting news um coming up in the very very near future if that is the case but with auctions every week on kusama until january 2023 it's only a matter of time until pichu gets a slot but it's not only connecting with Kusama that's important. Another network, this one of message passing channels, is emerging and is absolutely one to watch. This was found in Bill Laboon's Daily Digest, always an amazing source for unique ecosystem news. Over on the dot auctions, oh, Nodal with the uppercut, but an absolutely astounding recovery by Equilibrium. With the official release of their flash bonus, Equilibrium has pumped the rewards up to 250%, but Nodal with 300% for second time contributors, an absolute battle and the details for each is below. After this batch concludes, next week we'll take a short break with bi-weekly auctions lasting seven days each to follow, and it looks like Unique will be one of the first in the ring, along with nearly their projects like Latentry, Fala, Darwinia, Pokedex, and Crust. Fala World, by the way, some beautiful wallpapers. I know, not big alpha or anything, but just look at this art. It is beautiful. And now let's tackle this release announcement from the Wizards at Remark. In addition to equipping and conditional rendering covered in yesterday's episode, we have Dutch auctions coming for select creators who will be able to sell NFTs at a descending price until they find a buyer, custom attributes on NFTs, which opens the door for more specific filtering, Revealable NFTs like gift boxes or eggs that later discard the original art and become something else. The ability to add resources to an NFT or for original creators to push a resource and the long awaited royalties. Creators can set royalties up to 25% and receive that amount in their own wallet when a sale is made. They also solved the nesting royalties problems. But what if these are sold off the singular platform? A new attribute will be slapped on any NFT that changes hands in a way that circumvents singular or other supporting marketplaces. In a way, tarnishing the NFT until the unpaid royalty is settled and the taint is lifted. I just want to send massive congratulations and admiration for Bruno and the entire team. Thank you so much for everything you've done and the dedication to seeing this vision through. We'll actually have CTO Yuri in the studio on Monday to talk about the platform and what's to come. Finally, to play you out this week, we're going to get a taste of track two from Rich Valentino's album. I know, back to back, but it's hella sick. But it looks like the Chaos Collective might be dropping their album soon. Maybe I'll have something different to try next time. Sir, it has been a great week dishing the hottest news once again. We'll see y'all on Monday, and have a great weekend, everybody. Yeah.